if we think back to the original problem that we had, we wanted to solve the equation 2 to the x is equal to 5. And we've learnt quite a few techniques and things about logarithms since we posed this original problem. Now, I did say that in order to solve this equation, there was two methods, one of which we've already met. Or we've already met. So that was when we were writing the exponential equation uh, in logarithmic form. Okay, so we could write x equals log base 2 of 5. And that will solve the equation for us. There is an alternative method, okay? And if your calculator doesn't have that button, that log button that looks like this, where you can change the base of the logarithm you're working with, then the method I'm going to show you here is going to be essential. So the idea is that we are going to take logarithms of both sides. And for short, it's often called logging both sides. It's not a very neat way of saying it, but we're going to take logarithms of both sides. So we'll have log of 2 to the x is equal to log of 5. Now, once we've done that, what you can see is that we're using <coughs> a logarithm of base 10 here, okay? Because the calculator will have a log button of base 10, okay? If you don't have that button, then you really do need to go and get a new calculator. So once we're at this stage, we can use one of the laws of logarithms to simplify the left-hand side because the x can be brought down to the front of the logarithm. So we can write it as x log 2 is equal to log 5. And then, once we're there, we can divide both sides by that log 2. So log of 5 divided by log of 2. OK, now if we try that on the calculator, log of 5 divided by log of 2, we get 2.3. 192.8095, and that keeps going, OK? Now, if we did the uh, logarithmic form and we wrote it as x is equal to log base 2 of 5, that will give you exactly the same answer as this, OK? So you have two options here. You can either go straight into writing um, x equals log base 2 of 5, go straight from exponential form to logarithmic form, or you can go through the process of logging both sides and rearranging to get a, an expression on the right-hand side in terms of log base 10. We're going to go through the previous exercises on solving equations using this method in the next video.